one year ago today, a dog, Suki, was born. Uh, we were actually traveling in New Zealand and we were on a couple of waiting lists for a few whipper breeders that we'd found online. And uh, we basically put a down, name down for a, a couple of them just in case like we, we weren't able to get any. And um, unfortunately we found out from a couple before Suki was born that we weren't going to get one from them. And even uh, this one that we ended up getting her from, we almost didn't get her because someone else was uh, ahead of us on the list. They dropped out and uh, we got notified while we were traveling in New Zealand in a camper van that we were going to get Suki. And um, I'm going to insert a couple of photos here. Uh, and these were the first couple of photos. So these are the ones where she's with her mum and she's feeding and she's with her brothers and sisters. We were just so excited that we were going to be getting a dog and it was really good timing. So our trip in New Zealand was for about two months and about a week or two later after we were going to be arriving home was when we would be able to pick her up. So it was really good timing. By the time that we got back, she was about eight or nine weeks old and ready to come home with us. Kaylee was absolutely over the moon about getting Suki because she's never had a dog before and she'd wanted one for such a long time. A dog friendly beach a little bit further south past Elwood and now I'm depressed because we don't have a dog and there's people here with their dogs and it's really sad. Um, for those of you who don't know, my life goal is to eventually get a dog or two. Um, I've never really been allowed a dog so I think just like all the <laughs> like all of the desire for one has kind of built up over the years and I've just kind of like gotten to the point where like it's all I want in life is a dog. Um, so yeah, like the thing is though with the position that Dan and I are in, of course like being in an apartment doesn't really allow for it anyway, um, sometimes with rental properties, but the fact is is that we're looking at doing a lot more traveling and to get a dog right now probably wouldn't be the best idea and I would hate to get one and then essentially abandon it or just not be able to look after it as much as I would like and I feel like getting a dog is a responsibility and if I was to get one it would have to be when I'm in a position where I'm really able to do it and to be able to look after it 100% so it's a bit sad but I'm just gonna wait because I will get one one day right Dan yeah. yes She's even talking to us in the background. About to give her her two new toys. Kay has them both in her hands. already. Suki, how about this one? Hey, Suki girl. What's this? What's that? <gasps> What's that? What's that? Oh, that's a chew toy. <coughs> oh, she doesn't know what time to play with now. She's got four new toys today. Back to that one. <laughs> I think it's safe to say she likes them both. She's currently playing with her new toys. Oh, actually, she's taking a break from the looks of it. What's wrong? She's absolutely loving the new toys. There's been a lot of ups and there's been a lot of downs, you know, peeing on the carpet and biting things. But overall, she's such a great dog. She's fairly quiet for the most part. She's very chill. She loves sitting on the lounge. And uh, she's not vicious. She's great. Aren't you sick? You come to join me. Or you just want to play with your toys there. Say hello.
Hello. Oh, you're so cute. I think you like them, huh? That's neat. Oh, they squeak. I didn't realize that was a squeaker toy. Wait, which one? That one. I thought it was this one. Yeah. Oh, that one. Oh, yeah. You're cute. Are you having a good birthday? No, I don't want to play. I just want to chew. So this is one of the first photos we got of oh, Suki. She's so small. She was only like a few days old here. She was just sleeping. Look at her ears. They're like little nubs. Oh my gosh, she was so cute. <laughs> so oh, do you remember when you first got that photo, how you felt and oh God, what your emotions much, were? I was pretty much just crying. Like the whole time we were in New Zealand, I was like, you just wanted it to go a, home. It was a few days where I was just like so focused on like making sure that everything was moving along with Suki and as Dan said before we weren't actually promised her. There was a few other dogs that um, had been left from the litter but then the breeder actually got back to us and let us know that there was a female pup available and it had fallen through with her potential owner so we were allowed to to pick her as well and we just thought she was perfect and yeah it's been a very long year of a lot of firsts and a lot of training and it's definitely not been everything that we expected i mean you know i don't think having a puppy is it's a lot more hard work than i think a lot of people realize but yeah so worth it worth it in the end just to see how she's developed over 12 months it's just crazy to think that she's a year old now. Suki! I'm smiling. <laughs> she's smiling. <laughs> Can you zoom in? Suki! Are you smiling? I think that's a Suki, smile. are you smiling? Are you smiling? It's all smiles on her birthday. Suki. Look at them teeth. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. Everyone sing happy birthday. Right. One, two, three. <laughs> happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you.